enthusiast or buyer, cars or bikes, all that you need from the auto world is right here on the Auto Car India channel. Subscribe now. Well, the fastest, meanest Range Rover, the Sport SVR, had us completely excited when we first drove it with its enthralling performance and of course, all that oral drama. Now, the 2018 version is here and Land Rover promise it's even better. So why am I talking? Can't wait to get my hands behind the wheel. that the 5-litre V8 now produces 25 HP more with 575 HP and a whopping 700 Nm of torque. When you bring your foot to the floor and the acceleration just brings this massive grin across your face, shoves you back in your seat. 137 and I am still pulling and the numbers are going up equally quick. It defies physics. Zero to 100 in 4.5 seconds for a vehicle that weighs in at 2,310 kilos is definitely something special. The 8-speed gearbox that swaps cogs so efficiently never lets you feel the need to dab at the paddles. Put it into sport mode and it is insane. And then of course there is the oral drama that comes with it. Put your foot down whether it's the roar or when you lift off and come down the gears, the fireworks that go off. It's absolutely, you know, it's got just huge amounts of emotional appeal. And what's so special about this is not just about performance and oral drama, you can just as easily settle into a comfortable cruise and this becomes the luxury SUV it's always meant to be. Not only has performance improved, Land Rover have also tweaked the dampers to improve turn-in, grip and body roll. Weight has also been shaved off using a carbon fibre bonnet, lighter seats and alloys. It's, it's quite mind-boggling the way this big heavy goes around corners and feels so agile. Body roll is well contained and it grips well around the corners, inspiring a good level of confidence to carry speed. The steering is not quite as sharp as the F-Type SVR, but it is precise and it weighs up extremely well. With its performance and stealth, it is still a Land Rover at heart and it comes with a terrain response system that ensures these four wheels will get you through any kinds of condition. And it will scramble up steep slopes like a mountain goat, sail through slush like it has tractor tyres and pretty much conquer it all. The Range Rover Sport also provides you with levels of luxury that make it much more rounded as a product. The interior now gets a lot more. So the interiors of the Range Rover Sport also quite different now. You get the Velar-like Touch Pro Duo system over here with the dual screens. Of course, the top one adjusts so you can set it so the light doesn't reflect on it. And you have just about every control at your fingertips. You have the TFT display now, which is the interactive display. You have the steering mounted controls, which are also like your mobile phone swipe sensitive. And you even get um, ionized air into the cabin now to keep it clean. And you get gizmos that are a little different as well, like this gesture controlled sunroof. Let's see if that works. Yes, pretty easy. At the front, there is a striking new design. You get a redesigned grille, which is flanked by the pixel laser LED headlights. 
This is complemented by a new bumper with a more aggressive profile. The SVR version also gets increased carbon fibre for weight reduction and you can opt for it to show like on our test car. Well, what can I say? This is a car that just absolutely draws you in with all its oral drama and heart-stopping performance. But it's not just that. The beauty about it is that it can be that manic bat out of hell or it can be a comfortable, luxury, refined SUV that can go over all the rough stuff like a mountain goat too. And that's what makes it so special. Well, all good things come at a price and this is going to be upwards of 2 crores when you see it in June this year. But what can I say, it's completely addictive and if I had that kind of money, I'd go out and buy one. <laughs>